Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to generate any of the sheet music just from a MIDI files, just for any music. You can generate the sheet music with dynamic sheet music playing, become an animation, and how to create it. I'm going to show you step by step. First, you have to download this software, what we call the Mule Score. I already give this download link. Just need to go to the bottom, check the video description, click into the download link, and click free download. After that, you install in your computer, then you should be able to get this software Muse Score 3. Next, search any of the music that you want. Let's say an example is the third list. Then with the with the keywords you type MIDI download. MIDI download is the keyword. Then at the front you put the song's name. So next you are going to download the MIDI file just for download as a random MIDI file. Alright, now the first release with Dolven. I click show in folder, it is already finished downloaded. Okay, so Ctrl X to cut and paste on my desktop. This is the first step. Check the MIDI music, see whether it is the music that you want or not. Alright, that is great. This is the music. Okay, next step, you need a screen video recorder. So I suggest you go and download this. And this is a free software as well. This is a debut, debut video capture and screen recorder software. Or you can go and download the OBS. Both of these are free. For this time, I already download. After I download it, I already installed in my computer the bugs. All right, it's already here. Next, once you already download the Muse Score, the third step you have to go to the control panel to set up the system microphone recording. Not the speaking microphone, but you need to project the system sound so that you can let the screen video recorder record the screen at the same time also record the system volume, the system sound. So once you already open the control panel, here you switch to large icon. By default, it is category, you cannot see. So you switch it to large icon, you should be able to see sound. Click the sound setting. Then, at the recording tab, you should be able to see a stereo mix which already disabled. You right click it. Make sure you sh you already show all the disabled device so that you can see this. You right click it and enable. Enable this stereo mix. The stereo mix is a virtual microphone that project your system sound. For example, if now I play the music, you can see, actually this is your system sound. So now you, once you're ready and able the stereo mix virtual microphones. Next time, the next step, I close this. I close the sound setting as well and also close the control panel. Okay, now it's my time to open the Muse score tree. Once you already opened, you can close this 
because you are not going to create a new, new score. And now, you can direct drag in the MIDI file. The file format is MID. If you are unable to see the file format, if you are unable to see the file extension, you can just right click, right click the explorer, click file explorer, click view, click option here, click view. Make sure you untick high extension for known file type so that you can see all the file extension. This is the MID file. Direct drag the MID file into the music score. Now you can see it automatically generate for you. I hold the control to zoom out. If I demo again, discards. Start the mu score. Close this. Drag your MIDI file into the mu score. Now you can start to play. You can see this is a complete music sheet. If I start to play, Actually, it automatically generates the mu score from it automatically generates the sheet music from any of the MIDI file. Now this is the animation. If you click this, it will start from the beginning. So now it's your time to capture the screen and also capture the audio of the computer just by using the debug, debug video capture software. Once you already start this, next, if this is the first time you start, what you need to do is you select, draw a selection rectangle using your mouse. Then, now you can see, it's the time for me to just crop the part that I want to generate the music score. Okay, maybe like this. I record it as a video. Alright, now select. Later I can record it as a video. Then, next step. You need to select a correct microphone. Let us check where is the microphone setting. The audio setting. The audio setting, the microphones, you must select the stereo mix just now. The stereo mix. The stereo mix is the system sound. Then click OK. Now it's the time to record. Make sure you start from the frame one. And now, at here, I click record. Recording in one second. Now I click play. You can wait until all the music finish after that. From here, you click stop, then click cancel. 
Next, it's your time to find your video. You already successfully recorded this, this music animation with the sheet music. Now, right click your file explorer, click the file explorer, then click the video. It is under debug folder. It's like here. So this is the video that I just recorded. It's an ABI file. Alright, now you can see we already successfully captured the screen video with the sheet music animations together with the music audio. Now this is a complete music with the sheet music animation and this video is ready to upload to YouTube for your tutorial or for more advanced you can just drag this music this sheet music animation into your video editing software and then you can create the titles, subtitles, etc. At the same time, this sheet music you also can save as PDF. File, export. Export as the PDF. For example, I export on my desktop. I click save. Now, let's have a look. Immediately, it already, it already become a sheet music. Everything is here. This is a complete for list sheet music. All right, that's all for today about how to make a sheet music animation with music. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your animations, 3D animations and game developing, etc., and also making the piano tutorial. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also at the same time turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy and happy animation.